Ooh, what's up guys, and of course, welcome to episode, I do believe, 6? Yes, about this Nuzlocke, of course. As you guys saw in my previous episode, we did manage to beat this Yume Leader and got Rock Tomb, which is an incredible, uh, awesome move and obviously going to be extremely helpful for the rest of the journey. Now, having that said, we're actually going to go to an area now which are simply, simply, extremely hard. Like I build that up. But what I'm trying to say is next area is going to be a lot tougher for us and we're going to face Pokemons that are um, easily being able to take a lot of punishment, which is going to be quite, kind of rough actually. Though before going there, we're of course going to try to level up Scout Donut, which of course being Furrits, who are actually quite weak as of right now. Uh, also a TM there, that's kind of good. Kind of want dig. Kind of want dig here. Now this is going to be extremely helpful. Um, Airlace. That's not too shabby, though I can't... I can't seem to, like, realize which one would be able to use that well. A Cubone and uh, Frogadier can learn it. Now, Frogadier can actually be a, of use of that. I don't see Cubone be necessarily needing that. Um, take that over Pound, really. So, yeah, Frogadier is actually... I haven't really thought about that that much, but it actually has a rather broad move pool, hasn't it? So it's actually kind of cool. Um, very easy to appreciate, actually. Um... Alright, I don't know, you know, what stuff we're gonna get here and whatnot, but I can at least talk to people here. Oh, I get frustration. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. I definitely needed that. Oh, I don't want to speak with you again. It's the strength. Yeah, and now I think we're back into this area. Um, yeah, we're back on track. So you can heal me. I'd rather go to you than a focus center. I'd rather do that. Um, okay. Let's see, we're gonna face a Pokemon, already catch a Pokemon in this area, which means that we're not gonna catch whatever... There is X you! <sighs> it's so unfair. I so badly wore an X you. But we had to settle for Wishma. And that's a settlement I'm not agreeing with. I really don't like that one. Or actually, I like Wishma, but just in contrast to what I already got. Um, do you wanna battle me? Yes. Though I can't imagine she will probably have a weaker Pokemon here. Yeah, Jucklets. Nice. And people have, tend to have a thing for Jucklet. Like, people tend to like it a lot, actually. I don't know what it is. I guess people just like ducks. But it's a rather... Not a weird concept, that's unfair, but it's... it's I, I don't get the charm of it. Oh, live Leo. You got that boy. You're not gonna take this drink either. There we go. Suck it. Oh wait, you survived. Alright, buddy. I see you. Yeah, we'll see how far I get this episode. But I sh probably won't get into the third gym on this one, though I would really like to. But uh, I feel that's highly unlikely. See Oddish. And Oddish could probably take a strength since it's actually it's somewhat bulky. Even for a first stage mon, but yeah. No, no. Great. Anyway, and the last one is gonna be Pikachu, right? I swear I'm gonna score that static on it. Pretty sure about that. Pretty sure about that. At least don't. Yay! That's good. So right, there's really nothing here outside of uh, Air Lace, which actually was quite... It was worth the trip. Uh, it was worth the trip. And I already got my Pokemon recovered, which means I don't need to go through Poké Center. Um, even though I need to buy Super Potions, I don't think I need it right now. It's not like an imminent kind of thing. So you're gonna face a lot of stronger Pokemon already. Uh, like Sigilyph. Sylph is such a deal breaker for this kind of steel. I mean, it's so freaking strong this early in the game. Even if I pack Shadow Claw, I'm not sure I do 50%. Yeah, I'm not. Whirlwind, really? Damn it, I wanted XP actually. Hmm. Fair enough then. Oh, hey, it's a team of Flare! Alright. You want a battle, buddy? 
He did that gang sign, so I guess so. Let's see, Houndor. Should be able to do at least good damage on it anyway with strength, even though I'm naughty. Um, oh wow, okay. That actually kicked it out. H how about that? Scout Donut! Oh, Golbat. Yeah, that, that, that's not okay, buddy. That's not okay. And it actually outspeeds me. By it doesn't do too much, but it just flings me. Mm. Oh, not this thing. Oh, don't don't be that guy. Come on, for it. Figure it out. Nope. Not interested. Uh, I guess we're actually gonna switch out here. Probably the smarter move would be go into female Xenon and just go for rock tubes from here out. I don't think Bone Club effect and uh, or rather I hope Bone Club has an effect with the Wow. Came against something that can't raise the volume there. Hold on. Oops. That be hold on guys. There we go. Okay. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Alright, let's see. It's gonna go for bites, so that's okay. Even though it actually does a lot of damage, the rock tube shouldn't do too much. Yikes! That was kind of impressive. Oh god, that is close. Alright, that's pulled that out of the way. Alright, level 22. Scout on a level 20. Alright, how about that? That's great. Scout Donut! So, kinda need to recover my Pokemon here. There we go. Probably gonna sell a few things uh, when I make the next town. See, he has he has psychic Pokemon for sure. Do do do. Come on, Renan sucker. I am ready. Meditate. Can we two kill this guy? That's the question. The issue I'm having is, of course, that. Uh, well, let's face it, he could hit me super effectively. So for me, that's a deal breaker, so we're gonna get out and hope that he goes for fighting hits here. Yeah. Goes for Mind Reader. That's actually quite alright. Come on, Serenade, go for Ominous Wind, I guess? Detect. Okay. I should probably go for Minimize it. Ominous Wind. Wow, I actually killed. Oh, we get the boost though, we get the boost. Fuck off, but is it? Kiralia. Gonna trace my unburden. Fair enough. I am pretty sure Ominous Wind kills him. That boost should have made all the difference here. Yeah, I should knock it out of the park. Right, awesome. And we don't level up, of course we don't. Though Ominous Wind is definitely a move I don't want to have, but it's better than, you know, Payback. It's at least like a secondary stab here. Ah, Thunderstone! Could use some Pikachu, or P, P Shocker, if I decide to use him again. Let's see... Halucha! I really should run away. Um, I think that's Karate Shop and then Air Lace and Wing Attack, right? Oh, I don't want to 
fight you, buddy. I really don't want to fight you. I see. I'm gonna go to the female scene on here and hope that he goes for wing attack or something like that. Come on. Wing attack, alright? And that does... Well, not too much, luckily. But we can go quite safely here for Rock 2. Oh, the crit, alright. And then I gotta hope without speed with a headbutt here. We don't outspeed it. So that suck. Oh, it's so close too. Alright, I really can't risk it, so we're gonna over the potion here. Wing attack is not a nice move. I was kinda hoping when I got access to Rock Tomb that you know, I'll find a way for Cubone to actually outspeed things, but they haven't really gotten there yet. That's a Lucha out. Because you get so much XP from this. So it's worth killing it, though I don't have the matchup for killing it. Let's see. Probably need to level up Luca Libre. Which of course be my own Hell Lucha. Hello, buddy! Electric. It's like when I switch out to Pokemon that I kinda wanna use, I'm facing stuff that kinda hit it super effectively. Alright, Luca Libre, you're out, obviously. I'm gonna go to Canapis. And, uh, I guess we should wall this guy pretty nicely. Yeah, quick attack is not a good move, buddy. It's level 23 though, so it's actually fairly strong to consider the time I'm here, actually. Maybe I should be stronger, you know. The game does kind of have in mind that one has to use XP here at this point, which would have meant that my Pokemon would have been a bit more overpowered. Proper gun. Damn it. Still, you hit me neutrally at best. So I could go for a sleep powder at least. Because I can't hit this guy super effectively at all. But I can lead seed him, I can kind of stall him out if I have to. Or I can switch freely into Luca Libre. Oh dear god. Woke up and pursuit trapped me. That's not right. That is not right. Go, Luca Libre! And I do believe Erlais just kills it. I don't think it's gonna be able to take the tip. Nope. There we go. Goodbye, buddy. Get the fuck out, Grunt. Alright, another Grunt. I kind of want to see something else but poison Pokemon. Saying it like it matters. The Gulpin is back, people. The Gulpin is back. The time level 24. It's a Fred already. It's a Fred and a half. Oh my god. Alright, he goes for Encore, so that's good. That's good. We're not out of the woods yet. Come on, Luca Libre. Poison gas. Ah, it gives me poison. It's kind of like a smog move, I guess. Though I think I'm in an area where I will kill him now. So I think I'm quite right here. Oh, please. Where's Anisha? What's she do? Come on, buddy. Almost got him. Nice. So my fear for Gulpin is not as bad anymore, but still, like, scars from the past. I think there was 
as you guys are seeing, it's roughly one hour back in my previous episode where I faced that <laughs> Gulpy that couldn't be killed. Um, so for me, it's pretty, pretty much 24 hours ago. Hello, buddy. All right, what do you want to do? Oh, you look, you look weird. Griffaloon. Luckily, it can't hit me super effectively. That's the only thing that matters for me, and I do outspeed it, and I don't know why I went for air lace when I have rock to. Gusts actually hit me super effectively. Ah, it's not okay, buddy. I do have access to Roost, though. Which makes Luca Libra all that much better. Even with Gust in mind, this is actually kind of cool that I can actually take it on due to the, the recovery here. I like how Lucha never used it like in uh, in the game ever. Only used it in Wi-Fi battles, which is not half bad. But it's kind of cool to actually use it outside of that. <laughs> not you. Oh my god, not you. Alright, gonna go to Scott Donut. Or I mean, uh, female female Xenon. And, uh, oh, goes for Charm. That could be annoying. You know, the Thick Club in mind, that could actually be quite annoying. How much does Bonerang do? Charm, okay. Alright, it, it's getting there. It still kind of does a lot of damage, like surprisingly enough. That's not that bad. Keeps going for Charm. Alright, so now Cubone is completely shut down at minus 6. Headbutt does kill it though, due to Padrishu being, of course, trash. But uh, yeah, that was actually kind of impressive, wasn't it? So anyway, Xeno level up! Hey! Get Rage? No. How about no? Let's see, Hippopotas. Goes for Sandstream, and I am at minus six. Which pretty much mean I will not stay in. Gonna go to uh, Frogadier here. Uh, Frogadier here. Her -her. Take down. I don't really all do all that much. But for the sandstone, though, and I do believe Water Pulse kills it. I I would be very surprised if it survived that. All right, there we go. All right, that wasn't too shabby, though. Obviously, kind of threatening, depending on what you view it. And uh, right, we are actually back now. Great. So, here is where things get kind of bad, because there's a cave up ahead that is um, just screams intimidation, and we're gonna get an honest chance here to catch another Pokemon, which is really nice. Oh, I need to buy Super Potions. Hey, get in there, buddy. We're not done yet. So, I think I'm gonna kind of aim on leveling up a little bit because well just let's just say that's this the next area has a machoke and sigilith in level 25 if i remember correctly both ruining oops um, my previous run here so with that in mind i kind of want to redeem myself somewhat um, hello and of course, you know, check for usual things, items and whatnot, but it doesn't look like there's anything special in this room. Nothing here? Nothing here. Yay! Timer ball! I am excused for going out of my way. Yeah, Geo Sage is this this city is actually kind of a weird area. I mean they don't really aim too much about it in the game. But it's very clear that it this is something uh, something else.
which I like. I kind of like having areas where they aren't really fully fledged, or you know, they don't go over you know what is really here. Um, they just mention that this area exists, basically. Oh, an SMS. Let's see. There we go. Alright, we're only 20 minutes into this episode, which means that... I don't know what that means, actually. I'm just speaking at myself. But there is really nothing in the city, obviously. I was kind of hoping for an HM, but no. Oh! You want to Lucario me? Is that even a thing? I wonder. Alright, um... Wait... I didn't agree on this. Battle her two Lucarios at what level? No way. How high are they? 25. Oh, Luca Libre, you gotta... Gotta Karate Shop that thing. Oh god, power punch. Alright, we did take that. Can you take this karate shop? Yes, yes you can. Alright, let's try this one more time. Metal sound. That's my cue to get out of it. Oh, why don't you just die, buddy? Alright, you're gonna go to Canopus. I, I can't touch it with Canopus, but I can shut it down. Somewhat, maybe, I don't know. Do you know? I don't know. Faint. Alright. Uh, that hurt, buddy. That really hurts. I'm gonna go for Elite Seed. Keeps going for Faint. Uh, pushing your luck there, buddy. You're pushing your luck. You'll die next turn, and that's a good thing. <sighs> I'll probably heal myself with an Oran Berry and just kind of stall it out a little bit. It, it went for a power punch, which kind of means that I don't want to do too much against it. A metal sound, I mean, that, that wakes up a few things for me. So, right, Lucario is out, so that's good and bad. Because we still have another one to deal with, which is uh, just the best. Can I base level up? Yay! Can I learn sweet scent? Nice, okay. And Luca Libre level 21, that's awesome. Another Lucario! Why do you have two there? Why do you have two? Alright, Power Punch, alright, I'm gonna keep going with that. That doesn't hurt me, but that's something that I really don't want to see keep evolving against me. Um, and we can only go for Sleep Powder, and I do believe Leech Seed at this point, and uh, that's how we're gonna win this match. It's... it's not pretty. I'm, I'm not kinda aiming towards it being pretty, but that's really all I got. The power of punish, not too scary. Uh, and then we have uh, faint. Woke up, goes with faint. And faint doesn't affect, it seems, the uh, rocky helmet, which is kind of unfortunate. Consider my game plan. But okay. Gonna go for another sleep powder. You land it. Not the most exciting battle. Not the most exciting battle.
Damn, he wakes up fast, doesn't he? But I think we knock him out now. I think we knock him out. I don't think he'll be able to face or take this race to leave and lead seed. I could be lying. I was almost lying. It actually went down, luckily. But there we go! Canapes! You did it, buddy! I would have a scratch, in theory. So, piss off, buddy. <laughs> Holy Cory was like super, super OP this early in the game. Though luckily didn't have any like offensive moves that could push me back. Faint and uh, bullet punch or power punch is not too, not too scary. All right. He has two Pokémons. First one sending out is Zulesis. He's not feeling extremely comfortable staying against this guy. Um, probably gonna go to my Serenade here. Let's see what he goes for. Goes for Charm, so that's okay. I'm gonna go for minimize. He goes for light screens. Alright, I don't know which one is worse between us right now. No, no it's me. <laughs> it's me. And I guess I'm gonna go for focus energy too, because obviously I need to land crits. He's getting pumped. Getting freaking pumped, buddy. Goes for ominous wind. Score a crit. That's a crit. No, it wasn't. Wow, it just did so much damage. Yay! Get the freaking race somehow. As he goes for recover. Alright, buddy. I see you. The light screen wear off. I'm just gonna go for gust from here on out because I don't wanna, like, lose all my. Now I got the crits. Uh, what do you call it? All my um, all my PP for Ominous Wind because that move is shitty as fuck when it comes to PP. All right, and that should knock him out. We should level up. Yay, us! There is a Sigilyph. No, I need to go for Ominous Wind. Look at that! Look at that! That did nothing! And I am at plus one here! Oh, there we go! That's the guy! That's the guy I've been fearing! I won't let the Mashoke to, you know, beat, of course, get off. But the Mashoke is more manageable. I kinda hope. Yay, Citrus Berry! Before continuing, we're of course gonna catch our next Pokémon. Now let's see, what are we gonna get here? Oh, Hiriyama! Motherfucking Hiriyama! And of course he has Fake Out, you know, why wouldn't you, right? Hiriyama is kind of OP. Oh, it has a knockoff too. Alright. I guess I can kind of root on this. Because I need him to be at a bit lower HP. Smelling salt. Alright, and that hits me neutrally. I could risk the Karate Shop. Alright, can we catch a Hiriyama? That would be so cool if that was even possible. Yeah, we got a Hiriyama! Huh. That is just the best. That is the best.
gonna name you Majunk. Have to celebrate some somebody somehow. So Majunk fits the bar. Who knows? I might even use him. Hiriyama is so good. Oh, a horde. I don't think I have multiple attacks here. I'm gonna get a horde off. Nidorans! <laughs> horde of Nidorans. And no one of them are shiny. Alright. You want to never know. It's a horde after all. But yeah, I really, really want to, or I need to, kind of level up at this area. Uh, you kind of get a lot of XP here, but it also is that, wow, only one, that's a freaking Mianfu! Okay, buddy, okay. Uh, yeah, what I'm trying to say is that this area has a lot of strong Pokémons, which means I kind of need to build myself up for now. Just look at that, that's insane. Guess we keep going. Swift shouldn't KO me. Ooh, it's so close though. It is so close. Ugh. Like the journey before this cave is like nerve-wracking. Can't even. I can't. So yeah, I think I'm going to level up a few guys here because I really, really need it. Oh, shingle. Uh, because it, it simply is one of these areas where I could get so heavily punished due to uh, due to the level I'm at. So I'm actually gonna Ooh, night. Oh yeah, I did the damage on me. Yes, yeah, so I'm actually gonna pause this. Um, what do you call it? This uh, Nuzlocke from that because I'm gonna like gain two levels on Elite every month here, and I don't feel I want to showcase that. It's rather really boring to watch. So after this battle, I'm going to do a save, and then I'm gonna come back tomorrow with the next episode, and we're gonna go further into this monstrous evil cave. Let's see, that should not get out. Come on, get away with you. There we go. So yeah, thank you so much for watching guys, of course, and I see you in the next episode. Until then guys, take care as Scout Donut learns follow me. Yeah, follow me in the next episode, haha! <laughs> no. <laughs> anyway guys, see you in the next episode. Until then, take care of course, bye.